guys, welcome to Weekly Summary where we talk about all the latest gossips from the local to the international. Today, I'll be dishing out to you hot gist and I am your ever lovely host, Fina. To start with the international today, Drake has released his long-awaited album, Scorpion. Now, a lot of people have been waiting for this album. He's been talking about it since he dropped the song, God's Plan. And it also has songs like, I'm upset. Now, during the this thing going on between him and Pusha T, he did, you know, there was this thing going around that, oh, he probably will have this track in the album. And yes, it's there now. The, the track that gave it to the story of added on thing and all that stuff but yeah drake's album is definitely out and you can stream it on all the you know platforms apple and spotify and so on and so forth so definitely this is the album of the year because it's the album that everybody has been looking forward to i'll definitely be looking forward to a lot of videos and you know blown up tracks or tracks that would definitely top the charts billboards and all of that still on the international scene we have ybn almighty j and black china spotted together now just last week just last week i mean they broke up i mean it was all over the internet that they broke up and now they were spotted together you know being all cozy uh, in a particular you know place and I'm, I'm beginning to wonder if this is all you know some sort of trick that they're playing with our minds you know that that's how i feel right now because i was like Talking about it last week and saying that, you know, I expected this relationship to come to an end because it started and it's kind of not, you know, the usual kind of relationship because of the age difference and everything. But yeah, it seems like they're, you know, getting back together. Maybe they put aside their differences and decided, okay, we can go on with this relationship. But still, I'm still, I'm still not, I'm not, I'm not really understanding this. I, I mean, why, what, what's YBN and black china up to i don't know they're playing with our minds but yeah guys I, I i do hope that if they came together for real I, I hope something good comes out of it and maybe next week we'll probably hear that they're broken up again to the nigerian scene guys we have david o winning mtv awards for best international acts now it's no surprise because david o won this award in 2014 and this is actually not his first international award so yeah we were not expecting anything less, yeah. But it's definitely a good one for his career path because, you know, since last year, since he's, um, you know, the songs he released last, last year was like Davido's year, and this year has started well for him, and now he's won this Best International Act Award. I mean, he was contesting a lot of, um, alongside a lot of very, you know, big artists like Tiwa Savage, like, um, you know, people from Congo and different countries, and still he won this award. So definitely it's a deserving one for him, and we say big ups to him, and definitely expecting much more from, from Davido this year, probably an album. I'm expecting an album, maybe, maybe an album this year. Yeah. Still on the Nigerian scene, we have a sad one this week. Now, last week we had a sad news, and I'm a bit saddened by this because it's one of ours. Our music icon, the band, lost his son. Now, that's really sad because this little boy has not even lived. It's just, it's just a year old. It's not been long. He celebrated his birthday, and um, in about a month, he's passing away. Now, this guy is this. I, I don't really know. I, I can't even express how I think the band should be feeling right now, or his family, or his wife. But I do know that it's a great loss for him and his family. I do hope that um, he God consoles him because there's no amount of there's nothing anybody could say to make him feel better right now. But yeah, it's a great loss as the kid was playing around the pool and fell into the pool and he drowned. Um, it's really a sad one. I, if I were the one, I would probably just seal up the pool still love the whole place I, I don't know i don't know but um we want to say condolences to the band and his entire household well guys that's all we have for you this week on weekly summary on hit songs tv for more juicy gist and gossip don't forget to visit our website www.hitsongs.com keep watching hit songs tv